Hello everyone, it's Suzanne Skye this morning and I'm sitting in line at the food distribution. Um, it's just now enough daylight I think to just film a little short video. Uh, I left the house this morning at 10 minutes after 6 I think it was and uh, got here it was still dark uh, this is like the next town from where i live <clears throat> and uh, so a little after six and then the uh, truck should be here about nine nine thirty something like that so it's a long time to sit here but that's just what you've got to do if you uh want to uh, to go to the food distribution and I was uh, in the third line so there was a lot of people lined up ahead of me well I'm probably the 25th car maybe uh, and since then this whole parking lot that I'm in now is filled up and let's see and I think there's already an overflow in the, the little um, what you call it not exactly a pasture but just the grass space uh, across the driveway from this parking lot and uh, anyway but you've got to get here early and I don't like to just sit at home and wait and wait and wait and you know I want to be here early where I'm not too far back in the line and uh, you know the closer you are to the front the sooner you get out but <laughs> then I gotta go I've got to drive home and I'll be doing a food bank uh, haul after I get home so if you're interested wait for that watch it later I don't know what time it'll be. It'll be before noon, sometime between probably 10.30 and noon. Uh, I'll be tired because I got up so early this morning to get going. But I'm sitting here um, with cars all around me. And I think I'll show you a little bit of that, although there's uh, still fog on the windshield and everything. I don't know if you'll be able to see much, but I won't be shooting over where the where you can see uh, where it shows people's license plates um, or anything. But bring my water bottle. It's just tap water from home, but I've saved this bottle a long time uh, because I like the kind that has the this kind of top. So I've got water to drink. And I brought the book I'm reading, Samuel Pepys, The Unequaled Self by Claire Tomlin. And it's a good one. You can see I've got these marker things in it. I was interested in annotating the book. I'd been watching YouTube videos about uh, annotation and highlighters. Uh, this is all highlighted now uh, like that different colors mean different things but it's slowing me down you can see I'm just that far into the book and I've been on it for a long time and then I just sort of would put off reading it because I knew I would have to do the annotation and it really slows me down and keeps me from enjoying the book as much as I would so I think I'm through with annotation <laughs> I'm just gonna read the book and uh, probably won't be doing any more annotation on other books either we'll see how that goes this just has a lot to annotate or I started uh, with too much annotation maybe but uh, I think it does help you remember what you've read and if you want to check back, especially for historical uh, information and things, 
the annotation would really be help, helpful. It's what, about 53 degrees, I think, right now. So it's not too bad. I'm wearing a sweatshirt and jeans, uh, but I did bring a blanket from home, just a small, lightweight one. Oh, and I feel like putting it around my neck because uh, the back of my neck especially is just kind of chilled. I know probably those of you in northern states uh, are thinking it's 53 degrees and she's chilled, but heck, this is South Texas and we're not used to it. Uh, it's supposed to get up in the 60s today, so that'll be good. Uh, we just went through a bad, bad spell of really cold, icy, freezing weather. Two of them, in fact, but they're short-lived, just uh, a few days each. And, you know, here we are hoping we're done for the winter, but it's just, uh, what is it, uh, January 29th, maybe, today? I don't know. But... Uh, It'll probably still be cold for February. Uh, and we've had a ton of rain. Gosh, my whole yard looks like it's in the bayou or something. It's just, uh, uh, it's just covered in mud and water out in the uh, yard and the lower spots and the driveway. Because, <clears throat> you know, it's just a, dirt and a little bit of rock in the driveway, but there's uh, big holes now from having so much rain. Eventually, we'll, we're going to have to have that fixed, I guess, get it, uh, get rock uh, dumped on the whole thing, but on the whole driveway. But I don't know when that's gonna get done. You know, it just takes so much money to do everything like that. Uh, and I've got to get my flower beds, the raised beds in order. It's gonna take a lot of uh, bags of soil, I think, to fill up my raised beds. Um, I didn't have really enough soil in them for the last year. And now, of course, you know, the longer it sits and you use it, you plant stuff there, the lower the soil uh, goes. So, yeah. And then my biggest raised bed, uh, I made it out of cinder blocks, just stacked. And it, oh, it's got weeds now. I'm gonna have to dig it up and get rid of it. Bermuda grass is in it and that stuff you just can't really get rid of. Uh, but I can slow it down and cut it back a little bit if I just, I think, get a shovel and dig off the top portion of the dirt in the bed and replace it with other soil. At least I'll try that. I don't know. It's going to be a lot of work and uh, I'm usually in a lot of pain and have some breathing problems too. So it's not going to be easy for me to do, even though it is just taking a couple of layers of dirt off the top of it. But we'll see how that goes. Just have to get to it. And what else today? I guess. That's about it. I'll be cooking dinner early. Uh, probably. I don't know if there's a football game on today or not. I'll have to wait and see. And I hope to be watching YouTube videos when I get home because uh, that's something I really enjoy. And I guess I will see if I can turn this around and just show you some of the cars all around me. I don't know if I'm doing it where you can see or not. But anyway, 
This parking lot is full. So, I guess that's it for me today. Uh, well, not for today, but for this morning. Or for now. Um, because I'll be doing a video later, I hope, on the food distribution hall. So, anyway, it's going to be a good day. And I hope y'all have a good day, too. So be careful out there. Take care of yourself and your families and your friends. Oh, and please, please, please like, comment, share. Oh, what else is there? Like, comment, share. Um, whatever. I'm trying to build my channel. I think I've got 364, maybe? 64 subs uh, I need a lot more before I can get monetized and you know no, I'm not going to get rich on this but any little little bit of income coming in helps uh, so uh, anyway thank you for watching bye bye